So if you're a hosting provider, the question is, what are you going to put about copyright, intellectual property, in your hosting agreement or in your hosting terms? Let's talk about that. Hi, my name is Martin. I make daily video about business, legal, and intellectual property. What is intellectual property? Intellectual property is all about copyright, trademark, patent, and other one. If you want to know more about those things, feel free to subscribe. Otherwise, don't. That's simple. So uh, let's talk about uh, hosting agreement and let's talk about hosting situation. And uh, we're gonna talk specific about copyright and what you can put in your agreement about that but um, other stuff about hosting your agreement or what you need to put in the terms i will discuss in another video but for me it's interesting to talk about this intellectual property why because it's interesting that's simple and i don't have to explain myself so let's begin so what you need to understand is you have a situation and the situation is that simple you have a hosting agreement and imagine me i am your customer Okay. and i want to host a website on your website on your um on your server so i'm a customer i came i want to put my website on your server there are a lot of things that you can put uh, in a hosting agreement like um how big is the the space that you have on the server what kind of extra service are you providing uh what kind of things do you need to consider when you have a downtown a lot of things email service all those things but uh, not now not now no no next time next time for me it's important about um, we need to talk about uh, the website when you put it on your server and you need to make sure that you make a couple of things about the intellectual property especially copyright because when there is a copyright things on your server you need to delete it and what you can do is hey listen as soon as you um, but the, um, something that's not you on the server, I'm allowed to break this agreement and remove your website. You can put it in an agreement of any terms. So um, let's think about it. Let's think about a couple of things. When you have a hosting agreement, what do you need to think about if you think about copyright? The thing is, um, if you're in America, you just need to put, hey, in an agreement of any terms, hey, listen, I'm going to say it like this, but you don't have to say it like that. I can give you some things that you can put in it but just say hey listen as soon as you as soon as you use my server you need to respect the digital millennium act complement you need to follow those proce procedures if you don't yeah we don't have an agreement and you are your validator or agreement is that simple because you can do that when the service in the us yeah, so do that if the service is in europe just follow the rules in your country about copyright that simple so um what you also need to do is make sure that they do not put uh, um let's say copyright copyright material on your server and um i know you cannot make sure but you can tell them as soon as something is wrong with the copyright that you have the right to terminate the hosting agreement or yeah the agreement that you have because if you don't do that you can have a problem you understand because this thing is still on the server and uh, you can get the letter from the other party that you have to remove it so um watch out for these kind of things and there are other things that you can put in the hosting agreement and um what important is you need to when someone make a website or when someone someone make something on your server you need to make sure that it's clear who owns the copyright you understand what i mean and um, make sure that if they create something, they have the copyright on it. If you create something, you have a copyright on your server. But make sure that's clear because sometimes I see that people do not understand what copyright is. And they um, a lot of things are messed up because of that. So make sure um, you do that. If you have question about this and you are not sure about your terms, feel free to contact me. I will look at it and see well, where you can improve it. If you want a hosting agreement and um, you want to um, 
let's say if you want an hosting agreement and you want someone to uh, make it for you, a specific one, feel free to contact us. It's that simple. And um, if you have questions about it, feel free also to contact us. And next time I will um, talk more about the things that you need to put in a hosting agreement because then I will give you an, uh, an hosting agreement that you can use. I have a uh, checklist that you can use for hosting agreement for hosting terms. You can download it if you are a special um, Patreon on Patreon. If you have questions about it, feel free to contact me. So I see you in the next video.